the Joe Rogan experience. What kind of tr car do you drive in regular life? Please don't say like a Prius. No. That would bump, like if you're like, oh, I just drive a The other Tesla. day I was throwing some things into the recycling bin and I'm like, I'm just trying to do my part because let's face it, I burn fuel for a living. Yeah, right? <laughs> Think about it Talk, uh, in terms of how much fossil fuel. I, mean, I wonder if you yeah. could see like a chart, how much fossil fuel the average person burns. Oh, I would not be doing well on that. <laughs> that would not be, uh, I would not do well with the tree huggers or vegans of the world all the people loving animals like me i'm, I'm all those people i yeah. love the forest i try and eat vegetables most of the time things like that but yeah i also don't do my part when it comes to my job what kind of car do you drive uh so i've had cars for years through um through the manufacturer so um this past year we were sponsored by ford so i had a i had a ford expedition el i didn't know what el meant it means extra long oh so you I got extra a, space in the back. Yeah, it was. Yeah. Why don't they hook you up with a Mustang Shelby? Well, that's not very practical. GT three fifties. Yeah, Woo! I don't think we weren't even allowed to customize the customize the wheels on that thing. So what? yeah, it was bare bare bones. Because that was part of the contract. It's they just want you to what drive. You're allowed. You get exactly. a car, but you can't get um, anything dressed up. So. Why don't they hook you up with a Raptor? Something fun. Uh, I could have had a Raptor, I guess. Yeah. But Why didn't you get it? Maybe like trucks aren't really me. Whatever. No, <laughs> it's fun. Better than the EL. <laughs> yeah. Well, the EL's not bad. But uh, oh. yeah. So and then I had a Tahoe when I drove for Chevy before that. I would think that you would want something fast. Um. So then I I, uh, I bought my first car in. What's the last car I bought? Oh yeah, a long time ago I bought a mercedes ml63 amg it was like a suv souped up suv that was a long time ago that was like 10 years ago um i uh i bought a range rover so since then you've just been using manufacturer cars yep. from the sponsors because they're free dollars yeah and they're not you know whatever is free is free is that like a part of the contract like that's the yeah. only car you're allowed to drive um probably not but but that's the only you know, car if you're you gonna drove. drive to the racetrack probably right. want to drive in your yeah. Company car. Yeah, probably good move. Yeah. Yeah, but other drivers have other cars too. But do you think that once you retire, you will start like going, God damn, I think I need to get something fast. I'm not a car girl. What? Nope, not what? a car girl. I'm sorry to disappoint you. What does you. that mean? How do you, how'd you even say those words? I know. I, how'd you just again, say, I'm, I'm not a car Do you know who you are? Yes, and You're I'm Danica not a car Patrick. girl. Patrick. I know. You're I, a race car driver woman. I don't even know how many cylinders are in things. I'm just, I just drive them. I'm just good at that. You don't know how many cylinders? I don't know. I think we have eight. <laughs> That's so crazy. I just lost so many be, fans. Yeah. How could you be such a good driver and not know anything about cars? I don't need to. That's a good way of looking at it. I don't build it. I don't. It's true. I didn't have to go to school for engineering. Remember the beginning That's of our right. talk? Ten years old. Ten years old. I remember. So, uh, yeah, I just, I, I can drive them. You need to get yourself one of those new Shelby GT500s, 700 oh, yeah. horsepower. Yeah, I've you know, seen one. They just announced it. Oh, what? Oh, a Shelby. New one. Oh, Ford Mustang. okay, not the GT. Not the GT500 or the Oh, you mean the Ford, Ford GT. GT. Yeah, yeah no, that that's one. pretty crazy, too. But yeah. Shelby just yeah. put out a new Mustang. But the problem with those Ford GTs, they're awesome, but the paddle shifts. You want a manual? Yeah. You want a stick? Yeah, I like sticks. Yeah, it's more fun. <laughs> it is. Yeah, it's just... It's a little more racy. It's just more fun. Yeah, I have a Bronco, a 1971 Bronco, I and saw even it down there. driving that is, you know, it's a stick. It's like it's, it's not that fast, but it's just it just feeds your testosterone. Me mechanical. Ugh. It's mechanical. <laughs> you feel it's analog. You know. I just like my car to be good off the line. I bought a Lamborghini a long while back, and uh, it didn't have a cup holder, so oh. I was like, "Well, this is stupid. <laughs> this is not practical." So yeah, so then I bought the Mercedes. And that had a cup holder. That had happy. a couple cup holders, yep. So it was good. But then, it, you know, technology evolved and it didn't have Bluetooth to play my music. So I was like, well, I'm not going to have to get rid of this. And that was when I started driving for Chevy. And then I got a Tahoe and I liked that. And then I got a. An so you're driving for Chevy and they didn't give you a Corvette? I didn't ask for one. How could you not want one? you driving for I Chevy. I needed a practical car. If I wanted a Corvette, I could buy one. Oh, okay. I know you're good, but I would say, but like, come on, hook it up. I'm not, yeah. I, come on, Chevy. I'm, pra I'm not a car girl. We went just, over this. I don't understand this, though. I keep, I keep wanting to catch you in that lie. No, I, <laughs> I, I don't care. I just, I have, cars are like purses for me. I just need one nice one, and when it wears out, I'll get a new one. 
You don't like purses? Not really. Oh, you're really a care. weird girl. I just needed one that looks good and performs. Just one. That's it. Yeah. What about shoes? No, I like shoes. Oh, okay. I have okay. a lot of shoes. Oh, there you go. Okay. Yeah. Okay. You're a girl. I'm definitely a girl. But not purses. What I about jewelry? My own, I curled my own hair today. Whoa, that's crazy. How'd Did you my do own it? Makeup. Yeah. You I just, okay? My shoulder hurts a little bit, but. <laughs> Hairspray. <coughs> oh, what is this stuff? No, I'm very much a girl. I believe you. That's what, if people ask me, what what is it about you that people would be surprised? And I tell them I'm like much more girly away from the track than you'd think because I'm really aggressive at the track and I don't look very happy. And away from the track, I'm, I try and be funny and I smile more and I'm much more relaxed. <laughs>